let me sit down. Also, this might be a little TMI, but I went into the bathroom to use it, of course, for the bathroom things. I come out, or I open, or I turn on the, oh my God, I can't speak. I turn on the light, tell me why all the things that were in the garbage are out, chewed up, disgusting. Yeah. So I think the culprit was that one, or maybe even this one. Like why? <laughs> why did you do that? I'm hoping I don't find any miscellaneous things while out here or, you know, anything else. Let me put this down so I can like sit. Yeah, hoping I don't find anything I don't want to nor hoping nobody finds something they don't want to because that'll be it. That, that will be it for me, honestly. Let me tell you about my day because why not? So we went to the mall. Uh, actually, no. Before, okay, so this morning we went to Dunkin'. They didn't have any croissants, so I just ate my burrito from, or the rest of my burrito from yesterday, which, you know, hit the spot. It got me to finish it good, or good. Then we watched two, three episodes of Dahmer. We're on episode seven right now. You know, that shit is fucked up what happened. If you know the story, you know the story. If you don't, well, you don't. R.I.P. Tony. It's a shame. How many times he got like let off? Why, bro? Why? Anyway, back to like a more positive note. We went to the mall, walked around. I seen this cute purse. I wish I would have taken a picture of it. It was like almost 50 bucks. It was like a little night out, bedazzled. The mini purse, it's not like you're gonna fit anything in it maybe maybe your phone not no big wallet maybe just like a money clip maybe you could fit in there but it was so cute but i was like where am i actually gonna wear this to nowhere because i don't go out and that's the problem with that so i did i didn't buy that i walked in a few shoe stores seen one pair of jordans that i did like and they were on sale but i didn't get those either either because I wouldn't have anywhere to wear them. And also, I think I, I don't think I'm a Jordans girl. I really don't. Because I already have a pair. And I bought them in high school from somebody. And they were cute while they lasted. I wore them to a football game, dumb me. And I just never wore them again because they're honestly not my style. What do I wear them with? They're gray. I'm like, what do I wear them with? Nothing. So, but these ones were cute. They were like all black and they had like a little blue lining on them on the bottom <sighs> they would have been cute but i held off on that i splurged in pack sun as you've seen hey y'all so i went shopping earlier typical of me to go to pack sun i'm just gonna give you guys a little haul so the first thing is i got new perfume didn't know which one i wanted nor did I think I was gonna find one that I could take on my carry-on. So I just got the little mini variety pack. I, don't, I did try, or I did smell by the fireplace one in the store. This one, I would actually get. This one's called Jazz Club. Mm. Lazy Sunday morning, which I might put on tomorrow since tomorrow will be Sunday. And then there's also like a whole bunch of other ones that obviously aren't in this. There's only like five in this one. Which one was it? Like the coffee, cafe, whatever. I forget what it was called. That one is the one I would actually have bought if, you know, bubble bath. This one's not bad either. Maybe when I go back home, I'll actually buy a big bottle of one of these. Yeah. So I got that. Then at Paxson, I got this little necklace. It's just like a little blue heart. Didn't realize it was gonna be like a choker kind of on me. Like, what is this? Then I got this little headband. Try to do something cute with that. I got two pairs of jeans. I got these ones, which the, that's the material. These are dad jeans. Actually try these on, if we wanna be honest. I haven't tried them on yet. These on, I just seen them in the store and 
went with it. And then I got these low rise boots, jeans. Look at that. Cute. T-shirt, this is now the one. Little mushroom. Just a simple t-shirt. Say from Milk Tea. They're like 13 bucks. I'm gonna wear these in the airport. Nice, cute. Just simple. Simple shoes. Slippers, I guess I should say. And then the last thing I got from a Pakistan, which I mean as you can already see, I typically always get something from the label right there. And I just got this simple. I just got this simple crew neck and then it just says label in the back. So, yeah. Now I'm gonna go try on the jeans and show y'all. These are the first jeans. I don't know if you can really see them. It's kind of dark in here. I still haven't seen these on me yet either. I don't know where a full mirror thing is. Below though. Okay, not really doing it for the, the butt for me. Maybe it's the shirt that's throwing me off with these jeans, but. Or maybe the fact that I'm a little bloated. <laughs> but nonetheless, they are a little, I don't, I don't know. I can, I'll make it work. Let me just get the other ones. Maybe I also picked a bad time to do this because it's, as you can tell, nighttime. I feel like it's the shirt that's throwing me off, honestly. Not with these, man. Not with these. Cute though. Now I don't know what I'm gonna do. Obviously I'm gonna change again out of these jeans because it's 9.51. Who needs to be wearing jeans right now? I'm a normal person, that's for sure. Um, I'm gonna watch the rest of Dahmer tonight. I don't know if we're gonna watch the rest tonight just because they're like an hour long each. And honestly, I don't think we're gonna get done done with it tonight. Maybe like one episode or something. Evan Peters is playing, he just plays so good in it. I just wanna know how he is mentally though now, after all that. Or I've heard, I don't know. I've heard acting, like those kind of things. That's the word I'm looking for. It takes a lot out of you. So I genuinely, I genuinely wanna know how he's doing mentally up there because I don't know how I'd be feeling. I was in the same shoes. I always do. They always get my money. It's a problem. It's a problem. But it's okay. It's a healthy problem. Let me say that. Then we went into Macy's to look at fragrances because if you know Anna Paul, you know she buys a new perfume every time she travels somewhere. So I wanted to do the same or like, you know, start doing the same. So we walked into Macy's first and as soon as we get in there, boom. The workers start running up to us, asking us to try all this stuff. And I'm like, I'm just trying to browse, bro. I'm really just trying to browse. Thank you for your help, but no, please no. Don't like being a bitch to workers. But like, <laughs> she kept like showing me these things and I'm like, oh yeah, it's nice, but it's not what I'm looking for. Cause again, I didn't really know what I was looking for. This lady was trying to show us over somewhere and then another lady stops me and I'm like, oh no, this lady already is like helping. And then she's like, oh. And then she continues to like give me these things. I'm like, bro, no. And then we walk around, we're smelling, we're done, <laughs> we're done. And then we walk out because no. And my friend wanted me, or my friend wanted to show me this Prada perfume, but it wasn't at Macy's. So we walked to Sephora and that's where I found, you know, the perfume I have that I showed y'all. Those people were, those employees were so much better and more like laid back. We're not our asses. Let us do our own thing. Let us ask. And it was just better. So much better. Plus the employee that was helping us. Oh my God, her eyeliner. She had like red, like lined eyeliner on. It was so good. With the red lip combo. Very nice. Brows, got my perfume, left. But yeah, that was the mall trip. Fun, chill, you know. We went to a mall. Then we started driving around. We, driving to this, um, 
I don't know how to explain it, but like there was a big like pool and stuff and it was like beautiful scenery. We were going that way and tell me why they were having a wedding there. So it was closed. Oh, we didn't go there. We went a little farther down and we went to this garden sanctuary thing. I don't know how to explain it. I guess it used to be somebody's house, big house, like huge. Flowers galore, food garden galore you know you know and they were having a wedding there too but it was still open to the public till five so we we went and it was pretty i took some pictures <laughs> inside the house and I'm like holy shit how the fuck did somebody live here because it was it was like so fucking big I'm like if I lived in this kind of house with like all this land and stuff my family's moving in with me because there's no way and like most likely they had like the employees live there and stuff because come on that place was huge huge it was pretty 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 old we left it was getting hot. We went to In-N-Out. I got a double-double with no tomato and a strawberry shake. Now, I haven't had a strawberry shake or any kind of shake in the fattest fucking minute. You know, I was thinking in my head, I'm like, ooh, you know, th this would be nice, nice and delicious. In retrospect, I could have, I could have held off on that. I could have just, <laughs> got a water because I took a couple sips of it and I was done but I had to drink the rest we couldn't be wasting up and we couldn't be wasting but I chugged it it was like I'm I feel like I'm never gonna get a shake again it was not not it it was pretty bad well it wasn't bad but it just it was too much way too much then we're driving around we go on the hills looking at all these red houses and I'm like, holy shit. Some of the, like, these people's views, bro. Wild. Fucking wild. These houses, beautiful. Yes, you could have the view. You could have the house. But me personally, I want the yard. I want the front yard. I want the backyard. I want space to move. I don't want my neighbors being up my butt. Left to right, back and forth, you know? And I don't want to be on a hill. Because I, that, like, the thought of my house like falling off a hill that's terrifying and i know that's not gonna happen i'm sure these houses are very sturdy and whatnot but holy crap no and then having to park on a hill oh my god that's even worse that's even worse this place was nice beautiful they got a view of the airport the water the city under i'll give them that but then we started driving back here because my friend it, went to the Pitbull concert with his sister and now I'm just chilling here, waiting for him to return. Maybe I should take a nap. Mm, but if I take a nap, am I gonna wake up? Cause it's 10 o'clock or something now? I don't even know. It's something late. That's not even late. It's like, if it's 10 here, then it's probably one at home. I'm literally just starting to get used to this time difference, except I, I have been waking up like seven and six seven in the morning here perfectly fine obviously didn't make an outro it really just ended it there so at the end of the night i passed out because it was like midnight or something i don't know and then pablo gets back in the middle of the fucking night i hear knocking or something 
at the door, and I'm like, ain't no way, ain't no way somebody's trying to break in. Because, you know, we're watching Dahmer, watching all this, like, stuff, and you just have these thoughts in the back of your head. And then the dogs are, like, trying to tell me something, and I'm like, I don't, like, I don't know what to do. So I just shut the door, was up, and then I hear a fucking knock, tapping, knocking, banging at the window, and I'm like, we're like, whoa. And then Pablo realizes it's his dad, because he didn't text or call them saying he made it back, which, it's a good thing he got them parents. It's a good thing they care. But holy shit, that was like, it, what's going on? It was crazy. But that's how the night really ended. Um, I plan to post twice a week, especially since I have all these other videos I need to get out. And I should have posted before I started posting my traveling ones. Yeah, so... I'm aiming for two videos a week. Sunday and Wednesday are ideal. But who knows? We'll see what happens. So stay tuned for that. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video regardless. I hope you're having a great day, great night, great week whenever you're watching this. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.